Everyone's freaking out about COVID-19, but I'm freaking out about something I just found on my desk. So I was looking on my desk, I was cleaning it off, and I saw this tiny, it looks like a solder blob, like, you know, when you're soldering and you drip a piece of solder. And uh, I tried picking it up, and it doesn't stick to my finger. And then I realize that it's actually a liquid. Now, I know my high school chemistry, and that means that this is mercury, because it's the only metal that's liquid at room temperature. And uh, my guess is this came out of that switch that I took apart a couple months ago, but I did not notice this. I did not notice this piece of mercury sitting on my desk. A couple months back, I did a video on me taking apart one of these really old-fashioned light switches that was in my bathroom that kind of gave way to excess load. And I couldn't figure out how it worked. Um, and I asked you guys to tell me how it worked. And one person told me in the comments that it was probably an old-fashioned mercury switch. And uh, I didn't really have any confirmation that that was the case until today but it is very interesting to play with. I mean, I'm not gonna touch it anymore, but it is most definitely a liquid. Let me see if I can show you real quick. It is definitely mercury. Kind of an alarming thing to just see sitting on your desk. I'm just gonna throw this away. Jesus Christ. Here you can kinda see how it splatters. I'm sure like every kid from the 50s and 60s has played with mercury before, but you know, as a child of the 90s, I never really got the opportunity to play with metal liquids other than molten ones. Oh shit, there's another, there's another blob of it there. Luckily, it's pretty easy to spot. The first one that I saw was really big and I thought it was like one of my piercing balls. Let's see if I can combine, there's three droplets here. Let me see if I can combine them. Yep, there we go, there's... Okay, I figured it out. So if you or someone you know has random mercury on your desk, the best way to pick it up is Scotch Magic Tape. Not a product placement, not a product placement. So I think I've got the majority of it, so I think we're good. I'm just gonna dispose of this. I'll take this opportunity to thank my coworker Nick that donated these awesome tools so that I have proper tools for the job. If you saw one of my previous videos, I was testing outlet wire and using a shitty Chinese power, uh, power strip and uh, some really nice wire strippers and cutters. Awesome shit, thanks Nick.